Sunday of Pesach, Passover, replaces the portion of the week this week. There are many, many lessons that can be learned about the holiday of Passover. In looking at the story of the Exodus, we see that the Jews left Egypt in great haste. Hence the idea of eating the matzah that we are told that there was no time even for the dough to rise. And indeed, even before that, they were commanded to eat the Paschal lamb the night before the Exodus with their shoes on, with their loins girded, with their walking sticks in hand, ready to leave. And indeed, Pharaoh came in the middle of the night, after the plague of the firstborn, to urge them to go. This is unlike what will be in the future redemption with the Mashiach. It says the idea of the Mashiach's coming will not be in haste. We will walk to Mashiach. What's the difference? The Egyptian redemption was the first redemption from the first exile and therefore indicated to us what we should be doing now while we are presently in exile. The first thing that the Jews did was to flee from Egypt. That idea of fleeing from Egypt is alluded to in the verse Sur Meira, turn away from evil. And they ran out of Egypt and indeed the actual exodus of from Egypt was in less than a blink of an eye. That indicates the doing good the Asay Tov, as the verse continues. So we see our service to the Almighty now continues in a similar manner. Sur me ra tov. Turn away from evil and do good. Our sages command us that every single day we have to consider as though we left Egypt that day. And this is how we do it. First, by turning away from that which is in opposition to godliness. And then, by turning into doing good things to make the world a better place. This is unlike what will be with the imminent arrival of the Mashiach, of the Messiah. As the Prophet provides us with the explanation, that the spirit of impurity will be wiped away from the face of the earth. There will be no need to turn away from evil because evil will no longer exist. All that will exist is the doing of good. This is what we have to look for this Passover and indeed in the upcoming redemption which will be the ultimate one with the coming of the Mashiach it should be speedily in our days. For the Uparsha, I'm Herschel Finman.